What are your memories of memories of Manila before the war? Before the war. Pre-war Manila. You were about maybe 10, 11? Yeah, that age. What do you remember about that? You were going to school? Yes, we got, we got to school in Holy Ghost College. Uh -huh. And well, all our sister, we all went at the same time. Yeah. At that time. And our brothers went to some Beda. Because they're, you know, at right. first they yeah. started also in in Holy Ghost up to first grade, I think. Tony, I remember Tony, uh -huh. up to first grade. Or and then the, he transferred to San Beda because he was growing up. And you were living so, in the Lardisabal yes, house? Yes, in Lardisabal, that's in mm -hmm. San Palo. San Palo. So I remember every time after school, when we go home, we make a lot of noise, you know, how we are like a... Uh, battalion, <laughs> military battalion. Well, anyway, that's how it was at those times, you know. Mm -hmm. And then, on Sundays, every Sundays, I remember um, your grandma, your mom, and your uncle uh, touching. Mm. And, yeah, mostly they, because they used to live very close to our place. Oh, they did? They always... Go yeah, they used to live in G. Tuasan and we were in Lardisaba. So they used to come every Sunday, you know, uh -huh. the house. Yeah. We have always lunch and your tito touching will play the piano. And then my mom, my mother and, well, Chichang also plays the piano. But we sing and we like to hear him play the piano. He really plays good, mm -hmm. you know. Wait a minute. So tell me a little bit more about when, okay. when um, my mom and Toching would come over, and uh, they. Uh, my I remember my grandmother. She was raising five children. Uh, mm -hmm. My mother was telling me that she was raising five children. She really didn't have a a good job, so she she needed the help of you know her brothers and sisters to sort of take care. I well I don't know, oh. but I guess I don't know, but. Maybe, I don't I think, know. I think so, yeah. And so she was always saying how grateful they were that, uh, you know, uh, Tio Pepe and Tio Nesto and Charlie, all those people, yeah. and, you know, and they, they would help, yeah. Mm -hmm. So they would come over for Sunday dinner. No, Sunday lunch, lunch, mostly lunch, lunch, because huh? that's where plays piano, right. everybody, yeah. you know, plays. And I know, I know your grandma is very close to my, to Lolo Vicente Foss. Oh. They were very close. Mm -hmm. In fact, he is always, you know, uh, talks with her. And my well, papa also, my dad. Do you remember your Lolo? Vicente? Yes. Oh, yes. What was he like? <laughs> because he's so strict, you know. Oh. Because when we, you know, especially when we have to eat, Everybody has to be in the table okay. to eat all at the same time, you know. Yeah. He has to call us or scold us. And then when we're playing next door at 6 o'clock, you know, that's um, how do you call that? Um, you know, you have to pray. Yes. Uh -huh. He will call us and make us come home and we don't want to come home because we still want to play. <laughs> so that means uh -huh. he's very strict. He's yeah. very religious. Yeah. And then, well, I know, I know. It's always a religion with him. Okay. And uh, that was, do you remember Lola? The, Vicente's wife would have been who? She, did she pass away a long time ago already? Yeah. Oh, she did. Okay. I, I didn't see them, not even Lolo Vicente, the... The other Vicente, Saragossa. Yeah, and Saragossa, that one I didn't see, and the, the Lola, the, mad, uh, the wife, I took her name, you see? She was Lola Felicidad, that's right. where I got my name. Do you remember um, uh, Tia Who? Pasita? Tia Pasita, yes. Yeah. What was she like? She'd never married, right? Yeah. What was she like? She was older. Quiet. And then, Quiet. well, she has, you know, her skin, she was, you know, too color. I oh. don't know what that, 
what kind of it's like bleached maybe or something no i don't know what kind of i think she had some uh, skin disease yeah oh. you know they say that's from the liver i don't oh, know oh, I, I don't see. know you know they change you know mm -hmm. and then well that's what i heard from tita chichang mm -hmm. because she's the eldest mm -hmm. that she's very uh, particular about uh, marrying a you know a man you know he wants she wants somebody that is you know like a royalty oh, oh you know I she's see. very the particular yes ah, okay. that's so, why that's the reason she never she got married never because married. she couldn't find that kind of man you know <laughs> you know uh -huh. well anyway that's what i know only about chapacita mm -hmm. and i remember we used to go there in they used to live there in avenida rizal that big house there oh. we used to go there and she, um that was, she was living with her With them, with this, you know, the, the rest of the sisters. This, oh, okay. Not anymore the, that, you no. know, no. Okay. They were already dead, you know. How about... Um, or maybe with Chalurdes, because I remember Chalurdes used to live there in Avenida Rizal. Oh, okay. Well, they were together, you know. Okay. So, um, Tia, Tia Lourdes, I can't see that. Tia Chalurdes, Lourdes. yeah. She was married to the Rabago? Yes. Okay. Now, I haven't... You don't know much about that? I didn't people. see Rabago. Ah, okay. But he died of... I don't know what he died of. Okay. Maybe, well... Maybe okay. he had uh, something. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay. And yeah, how about uh, Dr. Eduardo? Ah, Dongoy. Yes. Dongoy. What do you remember about him? Well, all I know, he was, he was my doctor. <laughs> he works at the Australia del Norte, you know. Yes. And every time I feel bad or something, I said, Don't go! I have, I have to call him. I said, I feel bad. I have this, I have that. And uh -huh. that. He would already diagnose me, already give me medicine. Oh, yeah, yeah. So it's uh -huh. okay. Uh -huh. I like Don't go. Uh -huh. Then we used to visit him there also, you know, oh. and visit him also in the house, you know, because cha, what is the wife is Ladi or uh, no, Gelai, Gelai. A Gelai, yes. Yeah, she was a nurse, remember? Oh. And uh, both of them had asthma. I said, oh. doctor and nurse, and they're all sick. And then oh. the uh, the daughter, I think, had leukemia. Remember the no. one who passed away? No, I don't. Know. I don't. I cannot remember her name, mm -hmm. but. The eldest daughter, I think, had leukemia. Oh, 